All right, guys, we're gonna give this a second try. We are out at the Obstacle Courses at Southeast Outdoor Adventure Park. If you haven't seen the other video, I'll pop it up here. Last time I tried this is when everything went crazy, epic fail, and uh, yeah, the Himalayan broke down. But let's not talk about that. We're back out here today. We are gonna have some fun, hit some obstacle courses, a bunch of stuff to ride, get those skills better. And this looks like a ton of fun, guys. This is what I've been waiting for. Uh, yeah, this time let's hope it goes better. But come along for the ride, let's have some fun and see what we can get into today. Well, here we are. It took me three months to make it back out here. And this is just, it's so much fun, guys. Still a little newer to the sport. I've definitely got a lot of miles in now, but the chance just to hit an obstacle course and uh, just repeat stuff and get better. Like, look at this stuff, man, it's amazing. A little mud action. One of the main things is just getting to run courses multiple times, trying to get better each time you run it. Like we're out uh, in the Appalachian Mountains, running uh, the tat there. Woo. All right, getting better at those corners will be one thing. The hairpin corners. So running out on the tat, you take your corners, you do your thing, and you're done. A lot of it's not the easiest place to turn around. So this, like right there, didn't take that corner tight enough. You can just run the track again and get better. So let's try that again. It's definitely muddy. That'll be a good test for today. There's a lot of mud right on that hairpin. The weather has been just phenomenal here finally in South Carolina. Getting out of that, whew, getting out of that heat. The last time I was out here, I was about dying. It was over 100 in the shade. All right, nice little single track style. Get used to putting the steering with the old back legs, putting the uh, peg down. Weight on the peg, around the corner. Well, here goes nothing. And that was uh, a little brutal. Should we try it again? It's about balance, it's about clutch work, and if you guys know with me, <laughs> clutch work is uh, Something I am working on constantly and getting better at. But it was fun. Let's go give it a try. We're gonna bring it down to first. A little clutch, a little break, and let's see. That went better. This is kind of what I'm talking about is the uh, the repeats ability to do something over and over again. It's the only way to get better. The only way to make a good video when I fall. <laughs> you guys can get a good laugh. All right, let's try this one more time. 
definitely a little more uh, clutch and brake action. Actually, it's really just clutch. There, that was awesome. What? A playland, like a kid in a candy store. All right, so there's a bunch of places out here, guys. So that's just two there. I'm gonna go ahead and see if I can get whatever this is. Whoa, all right, that's steep. You just cut straight. Oh. Too much there, so don't do that. So there is when not enough throttle on the clutch position. Like I said, something that I definitely need to test out the most right there. So we'll get back at it. Those are uh, pretty steep up and then extremely steep on the down. Oof, yeah. So it's really, I mean, the standing, proper standing position took me a while to get down, you know, have the elbows out, kind of that weightless rider. Uh, getting better at hills and corners, uh, but as you saw there, those minute uh, clutch and throttle movements um, are definitely something that, that I need to practice at. We're going to keep riding around here and just have a ride, guys. Just taking a little break, getting a drink of water. Yeah, this is a lot of fun. This is what I expected the first time I was out here. If uh, my Himalayan here, Draven, went to have uh, just gone crazy on me. Um, but this is this is amazing. We've only done two of the courses so far. Um, a lot of different stuff to see. And uh, I'm about to hit, uh, I think they got a MX style out here just a little bit. I'm not going to get crazy like the MX riders. But get some banks, curves, do some single track. This is a lot of fun. Heck yeah. Oh my, what a beautiful day absolutely gorgeous if you are a, uh, a dual sport or adventure ride biker and you haven't found an adventure course or a training course in your area man you gotta look it up oh well somewhere out here this is a large property uh but there is definitely that mx course so i'll probably hit a couple things and see if i can find it i think it's on the other side um but that looked <laughs> like a lot of fun something I can definitely mess up on pretty good I'm going to see if I can track that down in the meantime see if I can get some single track oh I don't know what this one is but it certainly looks fun another little single track trying to get my peg weights get that foot on the peg hard and, and leaning against the gas tank to get my sharper corners down oh this one's got some holes as well well if I make it out here enough I might get to be a serious little off-road rider. Let's see where this guy is. I don't know. I think that MX course, oh, I might have found it. There it is. Got some embanked corners. Track one way only, banked corners and all. Uh, this is definitely going to be interesting. Good learning experience here. Man, just get a chance to get everything going. Let's do it. Let's see how we do. Get up in second gear. Not so touchy on the throttle. 
this is my first ever time all right on an embanked corner Pedal down, lean in, lean in. Definitely got soft sand between these two. Ooh, that is some slippery sand. That is some slippery sand. All right. So if I can get my foot down, really dig in here. Oh, that is soft, guys. All right. That corner is not playing. Yeah, this run is just mixed in with a lot of soft sand so your landings and your corners are a little different but there is a lot going on here all right definitely need to get into first gear for a few of these that was close man that almost took me out guys right on that embankment there's a ton of soft sand that pushed out um, trying to get my le <laughs> my leans right to uh, to kick out the back end uh, I feel really good that I saved that one let's do that again So that definitely went better. Keep the knee in, lean against it again. <laughs> the gas tank a little bit. We're out here learning, guys. You can be out here laughing. Tell you what, uh, the first, I mean, those are set up as uh, MX track bunny hills or whatever it is. Um, the Himalayan get around this first guys <laughs> um, suspension that feels fantastic to travel on it's really nice so that was the MX track guys that was amazing I definitely took it a little slower that's a little different than my skills but actually the fourth time around um, a lot smoother <laughs> Uh, didn't almost dump it in the deep sand corners twice took those a lot more efficiently is able to increase my speed I feel like I'm at school out here just giddy as can be I know I keep saying that this is a lot of fun uh, so we have the big mounds uh, the steep up and down uh, we have the MX course which is probably my favorite this is probably gonna run and grow my skills a lot uh, let's see what else we can find Oh, what a day. Let's uh, pick something up. Well, this day definitely got away from me. It is already 3 o'clock. I got about an hour and a half ride home. I wonder. I might go want to do one more trail. Time for one more, right? Nice rough single track. Oh, a little 
hairpin. Can I get around that? There we go. Ooh, a double hairpin. All right. Trying to throw some stuff at John. Okay. Definitely getting a little better at those tight angles. Man. They could have called this the uh, hairpin trail. Got some tight spots for turning. A whole bunch of little offshoots. I was in second gear, not first, not gonna make that corner. Hoo wee. <sighs> oh, so much fun. Yes. This is an absolute riot. I'm just gonna keep repeating that today. I do have to try to make my way back to the tiny house. Uh, yeah. So uh, this is about uh, half the tracks they have so far. So they have, uh, I think, six to eight. And I've been through three or four different ones today. But I suppose it is officially time to hit the road, guys. How much fun this is. Oof. I'm going to get somebody to come out here with me. But go ahead and uh, leave a comment below if there's a favorite track you had. Uh, if you wish that uh i would have fell on any of those close ones you know what i'm talking about um but yeah it's it a great day um leave a comment leave a like button uh hit hit the little bell and subscribe you know bing come along for some journeys we're trying to get better and get our skills up for our bigger rides that are coming up and uh we're gonna have some fun guys i appreciate you uh taking your time to watch the video this far and uh yeah we're gonna see you soon